Ooh, we have... Okay, hold on. Let me slide this all over. We can see Galarian Slowbro. He's got a shell ar a hand now. Alright. Here's some of the characters that we can see. More bike riding. Oh, Luxray is coming back. Ooh, Giratina. Uh, looks like this is in Japanese, the one I'm watching, but that's fine. At least we can see most of the news, I'm sure, most of the details. Eye of Armor, since this is going to be the first one dropping sometime later. Taurus and Scyther. Duraludon. Oh, Sundial, yes. Whale well, load looks huge there. Kangaskhan is coming back too. Buffalant, Lycanroc, that thing, I forgot its name. Ooh, Menshia. Oh, oh yes. Whoa. What is going on? Okay, there's a food. Uh, these are the two new rivals. Oh, they have their own Dynamax. Oh, Dynamax Slowbro. There's the beat. Oh, Blastoise and Venus. Ooh. Oh, those animations look so good. There's Cub Fu, the new mythical Pokemon. Which you gotta help him train up in one of the two towers, depending if you want him to be fighting dark or fighting water. Alright. And then once you complete the tower, he evolves to Ursa Fu, depending on which style you want. Oh, there's his 2G Max. Whoa! Actually, the darn, I think I like the water one better, but I think the dark, the fighting dark has a better typing. Okay, and then we're looking at the at the Crown Tundra, which doesn't release till way later. Ooh, okay. <clears throat> That's the new uh, dude that helps us out. These are the new two new Reggies or three? Wait, how many? Re oh, Reggie Rock, Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel. Okay. Ooh, Relic Camp. <laughs> Absol, Granagol. A lot of new raid spots. That's gonna be fun. Ooh. Oh, that's right, because you could do the legendary raids here. So Mewtwo Hole, Lugia, Groudon, Kyogre, Kamalgia, Dialga. Oh man, there are so many. You can battle them all, basically. There's the Reggie Electric, it seems. And then this one that looks like Reggie Dragon, maybe? Oh, the three new Kanto birds, but they're Galarian forms, it seems. Oh, we're not really getting info on them yet. Okay, well, of course, we're not going to be encountering them anytime soon, so that would make sense. Oh, what? Wait, what? They're updating the normal play too? Look at this. Whoa. Okay, hold on. There's a lot of stuff. Oh, 617. It's a lot sooner than what most people were expecting. Uh, is there anything left? No, it's just telling you the pre-order stuff still, and most of the stuff I can't really read. Okay, so hold on. Let's go back to the beginning. So here we have Galarian Slowbro. He looks to either be Psychic Ghost or Psychic Poison, as some people were thinking. Psychic Poison would be pretty decent because it gives him neutral resistance to Psychic, so Poison doesn't affect him, but you gain that dark, uh, the Earthquake weakness. Uh, you're still going to be weak to dark and ghost so maybe it's not that great psychic ghost might be great too but you're gonna be four times weak to ghost so you better hope you don't run into like a dragapult or something with slowbro it also depends on what slowbro's abilities are they might be given back regenerator but we don't know that yet uh, let's continue on a little bit more <clears throat> let's see what else we can spot through this okay there's items oh wait are the penguins actually swimming I just realized SQ or I forgot what they're called. You can actually see them. They're on the right and left on this screen. I just realized. That's crazy. Oh, hold on. This the this should be the English version playing. Uh, it's gonna be more or less the same thing, so I don't, don't really know why I'm watching. Oh no, it's the same. Okay, never mind. This one's useless. Going back to this. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, we can see Absol, Luxray, Ushafu, Water Style, Ushafu, Dark Style, Giratina. Uh, let's see. So you walk out and you see your rival waiting there for you, it seems. 
there's the there's the competition not the competition place the um, the dojo where you get kung fu so here we have taurus inside of the side i mean scissor is coming back that means a huge competitive pokemon is coming back uh, it seems then we have uh doraldon well i forgot how he's pronounced actually uh droidagon something like that and we have Wismar and X Loud, uh, well, Loudred and X Loud, I'm sure, is coming back. Uh, Sand Dial, I'm super excited about. I always want Crocodile, so I'm I'm really excited we're getting Crocodile really early. So I might make him part of my team. He's probably going to replace my Drapion since he has uh, Intimidate. So and having I already have Incineroar, well, I might replace Incineroar with someone. Else. We'll we'll see what happens. Okay, so let's continue. So, oh, Tangrowth. So that means Tangela and Tangrowth are coming back. Tangrowth might be a big deal. Maybe not because super bulky, but this meta is super different. So, mm, well, we'll see what happens. Ungoro we already had, so we already knew. Executor is coming back. Okay, interesting. So that means we can transfer a low end Executor uh, soon. Uh, Polytoad and Poliwhirl are coming back as well, along with Poliwrath and Poliwag, of course. Wailoid is there. Look out. He looks pretty big there, I think. I don't think they might have updated his model then for, for the expansion, maybe? Kangaskhan is back, as we can see here. You battle him. Buffaland, Lycanroc, we already knew was coming back. Um, I forgot what this guy's called. It's like Emola Gola or something like that. Uh, Menshfu is coming back. He's a pretty cool Pokemon I'm interested in. Uh, Fletchling and Talonflame line is coming back, it seems. Uh, dry algae, one of my personal favorite dragon types, is also coming back. If I can rewind it properly. Yeah, he's coming back. I actually have a shiny. Unfortunately, I can't use him in competitive. But I'm, I'll make another shiny of this guy if I have to. Uh, slow pokes running. We have this mechanical crammer, and it seems doing something. There's cooking. Dynamax cooking because look, it's got those swirls around it. So that's a they use a Gigantamax powder. So it's feeding everyone that's at the dojo, it seems. Okay, there's Mustard, the two rivals. And one of them at least sends... He's... Okay, so the shield guy sends out Galarian Slowbro. But it doesn't show what the sword chick sends out. At least I'm pretty sure this guy's the shield one. I don't remember right now. Sorry, I was taking some water. So then it looks like they offer you a Bulbasaur or a Squirtle. And I'm assuming either one of them will Gigantamax. Which, to be honest, Venusaur and Blastoise Gigantamax look amazing. I think they're better than the Charizard. And I was super excited about the Charizard one at first. Look at that animation for Venusaur. And the animation for Blastoise is amazing too. Really have to wonder what they're going to do. My predictions so far is Blastoise is going to do Whirlpool. Since Charizard already does kind of like a fire spin. And maybe Venusaur would do Leech Seed. Because Grass doesn't really have an equivalent of Whirlpool or Fire Spin. So maybe Leech Seed will be helpful. We'll have to see. Uh, I'm interested in running both of them, if anything. But I mean, I'm mean, i sure I can only run one of them. But we'll see what happens when when we, when we the expansion actually drops. Here's Kubfu accepting you. Wanting to train and such. Fighting the Taurus again. Okay, cooking curry. Staryu comes back, it looks like. There was another Pokemon there, I think. Oh, there was a Starmie, okay. Uh, so, Pokemon. So, Pelipper we already had. There's Poliwhirl. Scraggy we already have. Uh, what else is there? Okay, there's him evolving. There's the two Gigantamax forms, which... Honestly, I like the way the water one looks better than compared to the dark one, but I still think the dark one has, just has better typing. I might go with the water one regardless, though. Uh, but I kind of want the dark one, though. Okay, and now we're on to the Crown Tundra. Okay, here we can see the new mythical Calyrex or something like that. Frostmoth, okay, that was, uh, Lapras, Whalemar, I think, uh, Corvy Squire. There's something in the grass there. I didn't get to... What is that? I can't tell what these guys are on the bottom, but there's something there's something roaming the grass. I just can't tell what they are. At least it looks like they're roaming the grass. Uh, let's see. Okay, so it looks like this guy wants to battle you too at some point. So here are the three Reggies. So we have Reggie Rock, Reggie Steel, Reggie, uh, Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel. Relicanth comes back, which is great. 
Absol. I think that was a Vanillix behind Absol. Oh, wait, was that Litwick? I can't tell what that is behind Absol. I see the Karanagol, which is the giant snowflake, but I really can't tell what's to the left. Maybe I'm just not familiar with that Pokemon right now. Oh, it might be a Vanillix, yeah. Never mind. Let's see. More Frost Mods. So here's the thing showing off that you could do four person raids with all the legendary Pokemon. And you can basically see all the box art, uh, all the box legendaries. So we have Reggie Electric. This guy's guaranteed electric. Now, this guy, I still think he's a dragon type. Look at that. That, that kind of looks. Uh, I'm pretty sure this guy's a dragon type. He just used his thing. So here's the Galarian uh, Cancel Birds. So it looks like for sure Moltres is dark. Zapdos is like dark or something and um, no my bad dark why am i talking wait let me let me rewind uh, uh hmm. this gonna be interesting when we see <laughs> and then it's just showing like oh, okay there's the gigantamax starters doing their moves <clears throat> there's kofu again or sifu and then what gets really interesting here is is it looks like you could do double battles because they're updating the main game itself too. And look, you're doing a double battle with Hop versus Raheen and Leon. That's going to be super cool that they're actually updating the main game. I was not expecting that. Magmar comes back. Kingdra's coming back, we already knew that. Magnazone's coming back, I think we already knew that also, but I'm actually really excited for Magnazone and Kingdra. We got these, look at this crazy move. What is this move? Like, this guy is, <laughs> it's like almost Gyro Ball, but better. We have Aggron, Aggron's coming back. I think we already knew that, but I don't remember. He's there, oh, Slowbro's Psychic Poison. That has to be a poison move. Look at that move. That looks like a poison blob. Uh, uh, Galarian Weezing is exploding, so, wow. There has to be an English version of this, but this is what we got for now from Cerebi, at least, so. Oof, this is some really exciting news, I think. I cannot wait for this. And this comes out 617, so it's actually pretty sh uh, soonish, so. I'm really excited. Alright, well, that's all the time I have for now to record this, so I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching the reaction video. I hope <laughs> more info comes out pretty soonish again, but I'm really glad about this trailer.